All right, so it is chest and back day in the gym. So before I go and hit that, I'm gonna go and eat supper, which my dad is picking up. And then I will see you guys on the tripod in the gym. All right, so I actually lied. Before I see you guys on the tripod in the gym, I was gonna show you uh, what my uh, pre-workout looks like today and what I'm gonna be taking in the gym. So let me just move my camera for that. Got the Savage 3 p which is now sold out and I am almost out of. Of course, I need the water first. I only do like 14 ounces, I think. A little 12 ounce action today. A little 12 ounce action today. So I do one scoop, three heat for a little bit of energy because I'm feeling a little low right now before I go to the gym. And then also the pump non-stim so that I don't take too much caffeine uh, at night because it's like nine o'clock right now. Because I don't like going during the day at my home gym because, I don't know, just don't. Anyways, then there's that. And then, of course, there's the creatine that I put in here for the muscle endurance benefits of taking it pre-workout. So that'll go in there. And then mix it all up and you got yourself a great pre-workout. see me and then I'll drink this before you leave because it's like a 10 minute drive for you ish so then I'll have it all digested and be ready to get a good pump in the gym so I'll see you guys on the tripod at the gym So make sure that you're doing all one motion, pulling through, then you'll get that activation in your back, which is really going to help with that. So just a tip out there for beginning guys and girls. <coughs>
Okay, I know I don't talk a lot during my YouTube videos, but for this one, uh, the top working set for me was plates and 25s on the incline press on the Smith machine, so that's what I'm doing right here, which I believe I did for six or eight, I'm not quite sure. So that's what I do during this clip, and then in the next clip I do another back workout. For this clip, it may look a little weird, but I want to go over the motion that I have here. So you're going to see like when I stretch, I'm doing a wide grip and making a W with my arms. And that's really going to help with the stretch on my pecs. And then pushing together, I'm going to push my chest and squeeze at the top. And then I'm going to try and get my biceps as close as possible together and straighten out my arms, which is really going to help with the contraction. Just for another voiceover, I'm doing close grip pull downs in this clip here, and then for the next few clips, um, that is for upper lats and is going to help build that size and width in the upper lat muscle.
from the gym and it's pretty late so I'm gonna make myself a post-workout meal so let's get right into that and then I'll pop up the macros as I'm making it <laughs> somewhere and then um, it's just grilled and ready Tyson chicken that you can get from Walmart with buffalo sauce on it so it's got a lot of protein which will help with um, building muscle obviously so I will see you guys in the next video <laughs> 